What's up everybody, welcome to Money Management channel. My name is Andrei and today I'm going to be doing an update on BNGO ticker. And on today's video, first of all, I will show you where we are on the price chart and how we get there. Then I will continue with some fundamental news and uh, with a very good uh, potential catalyst that might be in the near future. And at the end of this video, I will show you the probable outcome for this stock. And before we get into all of that, if you guys would like to take a part in the limited time offer from Webull and earn two free stocks valued up to $2300, just open new account, deposit only $5 and choose your free stocks, link in my description. So let's start with the price chart. I made my previous video several days ago and we were somewhere at this point and uh, I've told you that uh, we might hover for quite some time to hit the highest uh, border of uh, this channel and let me show you that uh, we are still moving down in this channel and this channel is very bullish because usually this pattern breaks to the upside and we have to prepare for this price action and uh, let me show you that we will have uh, one of the catalysts on august the 4th and uh, let me show you that it will be a second quarter financial results and uh, they will take place on august the 4th so and uh, from this point we might have uh, major information that uh, might break the upper resistance and we might uh, have a breakout and then our next targets might be at the levels of around uh, 11 dollars so and uh, for now let's continue with the fundamentals and uh, let's start with the company profile Bionana Genomics uh, operates as a life science instrumentation company in the genome analysis space. The company develops and markets the Subfear system, a platform for ultra-sensitive and ultra-specific structural variation detection that enables researchers and clinicians to accelerate the search uh, for new diagnostics and therapeutic targets and to streamline the study of uh, changes in chromosomes. And I have to say that uh, this company has a very, very good product and uh, it is well protected from the intellectual uh, property standpoint. And uh, for now, they don't have much sales and they don't have uh, much revenues. And that's why uh, their total market cap for now is 1.65. It is a relatively small company according to their market cap. And they have a revenue of... Uh, 10.53 million dollars with a negative net income of 40.54 million dollars but they have a rather good uh, revenue growth of 11.93 percent and uh, they have a total cash position of uh, more than three, 360 million dollars with a total debt of uh, only 14.87 million dollars and they have very very good uh, current ratio and quick ratio and for now it is at levels uh, of uh, 51.65 and 50.78 respectively. So from the financial standpoint uh, I think this company is very stable despite of this uh, negative net income because uh, they are pretty much in R&D uh, mode and uh, they still don't have uh, much sales but uh, in a matter of a couple of days we will see what is the current level of uh, their sales and in my opinion uh, during last quarter they have uh, around uh, 15 sales of uh, their subfuel system and some estimations have a projections of uh, around uh, 20 sales and this information will drastically improve their financials let me show you their estimations so the earnings per share should be at the level of negative uh, 4 cents and the revenue estimate uh, should be at the level of uh, 3.52 million dollars so I think uh, this company might easily increase the revenue estimates and uh, we will see. I don't want to make uh, some uh, speculations. I just want to see this uh, data and uh, then we will make some projections uh, for the price of this stock. So, and let's continue with the system itself. Right here on their website, you can find uh, all the necessary information about their uh, mapping system. And I want to pay your attention on this information. They have uh, three ways to get Bionena data. If you want, uh, you can get uh, this uh, system as a service. And uh, if you have this system, you, will ha you can have the uh, consumables. Or if you don't have it, you can buy the entire system. And uh, these two waves implies that you have to buy some consumables for the system. And uh, this means they have monthly recurrent revenue. And the more systems uh, they will sell, the higher will be the level of uh, their revenues. And on top of that, you can use uh, this uh, system as a service. And it is uh, extremely important for small laboratories. 
So, let me show you this information. On uh, their blog section, they have a lot of uh, articles that are pointing to their advantages and uh, that are pointing to some uh, testimonials for their product. And uh, in my opinion, it is a very useful and uh, very promising uh, information that you can find right here. And uh, I want to pay your attention that for now I am thinking uh, from the scientist standpoint. I am not a scientist, but uh, let me show you this. Right here on their latest news, uh, you can find this uh, news that was published on July 27th. And let me show you more thoroughly. Banana Genomics announces a record number of optical genome mapping presentations scheduled to appear at the annual Cancer Genomic Consortium meeting from August 1st to 4th, 2021. And let me quote you this. BNGO today announced a record number of optical genome mapping presentations. Across this four-day event, the meeting features 10 presentations by BioNano's Subfure customers, highlighting the benefits of OGM for clinical research applications in solid tumor analysis, hematological malignancies, product of conception, prenatal and postnatal constitutional genetics. And here is uh, the schedule itself. And uh, basically it is uh, very, very good uh, from the scientist standpoint that they will have uh, this type of information from the people who already made uh, these essays. And uh, on their uh, Twitter page, on their official Twitter page, you can find the information that was published just uh, recently, for example, seven hours ago. They already have uh, the summary of uh, the usage of this system. And it is a very, very good testimonials. And uh, the results of uh, this system is really outstanding. And think of it like this. If you're a scientist and uh, if you're using uh, some old methods to make uh, your essays, and just occasionally you found this information that uh, there is a system, optical genome mapping system, that allows you to make more detailed analysis uh, of your studies and that allows you in the long run to save your granted basically money. And this will give you more information with the less period of time. What should you do if you want to be a successful scientist? Definitely you will try to find the way to have this system. And uh, this will drastically improve uh, the financials of uh, BNGO. And that's why, let me show you the latest information from institutional investors. And for now, uh, they have, according to fintel.io, for now they have 154 uh, total number of institutional investors. 141 of them uh, have a long position, 5 of them have a short position, and uh, 8 of them uh, have a mixed position. And let me show you the latest sentiment. As you can see, the green rows indicate the new positions, red rows indicate closed positions. And we have more green rows than the red ones. And let me show you that uh, green rows, for example, have a position of uh, $5.1 million, $2.7 million, $4.4 million. It is just latest three positions. And let me show you the amount of closed positions. For example, this company, they closed the position of 10 shares. It is ridiculous. <laughs> Next one they closed position of $2,000. Next one, right here, just 500 shares, $2,000 as well. So, the red lines is not so significant and that's why you have to keep an eye on this company. So, and let's continue with the technical analysis, but before we dive deep right here, please subscribe to my channel, hit notification bell and hit the like button. This helps me a lot. So, as you can see, we are still moving down with this channel and for now we have the recent movement that is hovering around the level of 0.618 and 0.65 and let me show you more thoroughly this movement. As you can see, we have uh, some kind of consolidation phase on a microscopic uh, scale and let me show you this. This is the resistance and this might be a support. And what do we have here? Basically, we have uh, the apex of these two lines that is pointing us to this uh, August the 4th and it is earnings report. This means we might have a breakout from this pattern around August the 4th and from this point we might have a huge uh, upside movement. Of course, we have a possibility to move uh, lower, but in my opinion, this outcome is not so probable. But in this case, our next potential support line is at uh, 0.786 level and it is a price point, it is at price point of 5.24. And uh, let me show you our major targets. 
To project targets, I pull the Fibonacci extension tool from the very bottom of the entire structure to the very top and third point at the bottom of the retracement. And with the assumption that we have to land the top of our third wave, we have our primary target at the level of $28.7 and uh, we might hit this target in a matter of uh, 18 months in my opinion. But our closest targets right here, let me show it to you, we have to break uh, this uh, previous uh, resistance at the level of around $9.22, next one right here at $9.95 and next one right here at the top of uh, B wave of retracement from the very top to this uh, bottom. And uh, from our current price we might have about 59% uh, to our first target, about 70% uh, to our second target and around 101% uh, to our third target. And this target we should hit in a matter of uh, one month. So, it is a rather good swing trade and you have to keep an eye on the level of uh, 0.786. It is potentially a uh, next accumulation point if we will break uh, this formation to the downside. And uh, basically, with that being said, please subscribe to my channel, hit notification bell and hit the like button. This helps me a lot. See you guys and girls next time. Bye!